Afghans are scrambling to leave Kabul, fearing persecution by the Taliban. But there are a few who have decided to stay, even though they know that dark days are coming. One of them is Afghanistan's last Jew. Zebulon Simontov said that he had the chance to escape to the U.S., but he is unwilling to leave his home. He had also mulled moving to Israel, where his family lives. The 62-year-old had said that the Taliban considers him an infidel. Simento was born in Afghanistan's Herat province and has spent his life witnessing turmoil. He has seen it all, the Soviet invasion, the Afghan civil war and the first Taliban rule. He is now bracing himself for the second Islamic Emirate regime. Simentov has said that the Taliban tried to convert him in the past. Sikau India usaha mira, ojek musim mula mira, ojek di India sikau India ni dera. Ada soalan tinggi, kau bicik sana ni macam ni. Beris besar, shalok, kebal. Tuh amu amu tole, amu tole, bisak bisak sor bis amu tole. He said that he even went to prison four times. So what made him stay on? The 62-year-old is a caretaker of the last operational synagogue in Kabul. He said that the synagogue would have fallen into despair had it not been for him. Seventy years ago, Afghanistan was home to 5,000 Jews, but their population began dwindling after 1948, when Jews started migrating to Israel. The remaining Jews left following years of turmoil, which culminated into the Taliban's rule. Our correspondent Anas Malik gets you more. The last Jew in Afghanistan goes to stay back and remain in his country regardless of who so ever rules the country. Anas Malik in Kabul, Afghanistan for Vion World is One. Vion World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.